Alright guys, we are back. Alright guys, and we're back for another episode of New Vision with Iron's 520. That's me. Alright, this time we're playing Reaper. A, uh, a Tale of the Pale Sword. So it looks like a ninja game given that cover. And this is the first thing it tells me. It says, it's been over a decade since the Imperium set foot in the world, set foot in the wilderness. Hungry for her wealth of natural resources. The Imperium decided to bring wilderness into the fold, either voluntarily or by force. Yet the colonization never happened. Proud and averse, wilderlings tribes fought back, matching the Imperial war machine. War machine with fierce sorcery. After years of perpetual war, both sides grew weary and exhausted. Conflict turned into stalemate. Now the Imperials merely defend what little ground they've claimed, while the only, only the most radical of wilderlings still continue to fight them. All blissfully unaware of what is to come. In a cave deep within the heart of wilderness, a swordsman awakens. That's me. So... W-A-S-D. Space button. Charge. Okay, auto attacks. And these are, I don't know, uh, gold coins and gold beans? I don't know, I don't know. I'm gonna go back, alright. Skulls of Rage. Press up to perform an uppercut. Oh no! Whoa! Which, which one's this one? Down. Alright, cool. I got a couple of moves there, it looks like. Crush the enemies below you. Nice. Ground pound. Whirlwind flurry. Double press space when in the air. Nice. Where are we going next? Come on. Stand in the light when there's no more enemies in the arena. I think I bailed on the slime monster. Yep, there he is. Alright. Go, go, go! Go, run! Dash it, run thing! Go! Come on! Boom! Alright! Wait a minute. <coughs> it says I'm 100% complete. What am I missing? Oh. That's a strange spot for that. Ancient cave, dark and gold place buried deep within the mountain. Overgrown trail. Let's travel passage to the wilderness. I guess that's the next spot. What a rare treat it is to find a living soul in these parts. Are you alright? You look pale. You look even worse. Oh well, wait, is that a sword? I would feel much safer in the company of a swordsman. My home isn't far. Would you mind if I joined you for a while? 
fine. Just don't get in my way. Travel with old grade to his hut. Humble abode belonging to an old outcast. I've been attacked by a razorback. Come on, come on, take him out. Yeah. Take him, take him, take him, take him. Oh, I can't, I can't attack him pretty much at all like that. Okay. Give me some bo some bacon. Bacon. All right, let's go through this thing. Go. How do you use it? I just click on it. Alright, score 97 go collect the five experience gain fifteen. Alright, what an awful beast. Razorbacks don't usually attack humans on sight. Something's off is somewhere. That's sure. Ah, I've forgotten to thank you properly for your excellent swordsmanship. I might even hire you again someday. Thanks. Woohoo! Alright, level one plus Plus, plus, plus. You go first, Thunder follows. Speed or strength? Yeah, because we don't need any help. Um, speed. Okay, Grey Hat. Quest. Oh, now that I think of it, there is something suspicious going on. There's a place in the woods frequently visited by Imperial soldiers. There are, they are always going about all. Hush, hush, certainly up to no good. You might want to check it out. Interesting. Hidden in the woods, secret cache. Deep in the woods, three Imperial soldiers are just about to bury a treasure chest. Attack! Take out those soldiers. Oh, they have guns. Why do they have guns? Oh, he doesn't. He's got a spear. But it doesn't seem that I get to avoid it. Take him! Take it as night! Ha ha! <coughs> now we take their treasure! Oh wow. Let's just start down here. Go, 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 alright. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Okay, that was, uh, another level. These aren't like numerical levels. So we'll just take it, uh, what else do we got? We'll go a little further. So, Zavas tribe, pumpkin farmer, the only tribe collaborating with Imperials. Oh, we're gonna have to go talk to these guys then. You know what I'm saying? I've been attacked by Zavas outcast. Not for long. Take him. Take him too. Ah. That was easy. Zavas outcasts are soft. They are soft. Ooh, that was a lot more gold. Oh, I've seen you fight those cursed outcasts. Remind me not to get on your bad side. You look like one of them. Tava. Yeah, don't get me started. Outcasts wear their soul masks marked with tribal colors. Murderous ref traitors refuse to give them up. P to it. Alright. Radicals who can't forgive us for making peace with the Imperium. We cast them out. They've been terrorizing the land ever since. Oh, well, you don't look very well. Is there anything I can do for you? I want a better sword come again? Ah, uh, that thing. You should visit Miko, a blacksmith. She lives in the stone house by the river. Well, let's go to Miko's house. Blacksmith Miko lives here. Hi there. Holy whack-a-moly. What are you? Sorry, I don't mean to be rude. I'm just not used to meeting 
foreigners too often. Look who's talking, right? Imperial migrant working metal in a land where farmers don't even use tools. Why don't they? You're pretty new to wilderness, aren't you? Wilderlings use magic for everything. My tribe, I mean, Zava's tribe, they grow magically enhanced pumpkins and weed. No hard work needed. When they go out hunting, they just throw spells at the forest. So what do you do? I make things that need to last. Mostly locks and keys, reinforced doors, animal cages, and mint golden coins. Magic is fickle. Gold is forever. Hmm. That's an unusual request. I can make you a new one, or I can import historic swords from the Imperium. Either way, it's going to be expensive. Visit me in my shop, and I'll see what I can offer. Okay, we could have done that right there. That's kind of weird. Alright, Miko the Blacksmith sells armor, some restored, others custom made. Okay, so... Ancient Blade, Ancient Blade... What is this? What is this? What is okay, she's got six, six... Um, um, how much gold do I have? Oh, I don't have no gold, okay. <coughs> Excuse me, alright. Oh, this stuff is expensive. I can't find none of that yet. I can sell that, right? Yeah, how much does she give me now? Or is that my gold? Can't sell that. Okay, so what's better? Armor 10, speed plus 6. What about this? Oh, that's expensive. I should be able to do it. Nope. Crud. I got some boots. Travel. Zavas tribe. Pumpkin farmers. Uh, hey, you sword boy, or is it a sword girl? What are you exactly under that cape? Death! No, please, please, please don't take me yet! You, you're just joking, right? Slay him! Boss is dying. I knew you were... Go to... Wetlands. They're in wetlands. Who? Boss is dead. I got 50 gold for it, though, so let's just leave. You gained 100 experience points and got 50 gold. Wetlands infested with suspiciously high quantities of poison slime. Oh, there's another quest up there. We'll have to go back up there. Take the slime! Yeah! I don't know why I had that other sword. This one's just fine. There's a lot of these guys. No, no. Get back up there. Yes! Oh my gosh, there's a lot of little slimies. Doesn't seem to matter what game I'm playing, I always come across the slime. So we'll probably do this level, and we might do one more, and then I'll uh, cut this one out. Oh, uh, no, that's probably the last one. Oh, no! Oh, no! No! Oh, cool, I came back. I must actually be dead. Oh, I'm getting hit. Come on. They're hurting me. 
Yeah. Oh, I died. Oh, all right, guys. So that's Reaper, the Tale of the Pale Swordsman. Uh, drop me a comment. If you uh, want to see another one, and if you like the video, uh, give me a like. And if you want to see more New Vision videos, subscribe to my channel. All right. I'm out. Peace.